give you a quick introduction that you in this bitch. And then uh, I'm going to play take this money real quick, man. Right. And then after that, we'll go right on right after that. We play now every day. We've been playing that bitch since it came up. Yeah. Um, so we play that every hour anyway. So we're gonna play this hour. But I'm gonna. I just wanna kind of get people. Uh, Big, 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 big business today, man. I got the homie, man, the hottest rapper in Florida right now, man. Mr. Mike Smith in the building, man. Right now, I know y'all here right now. The Chase This Money instrumental going down right now. We're going to get into the Chase This Money real quick. Right after that, man, we're going to talk to Mike Smith all day, man, about all the latest news. Definitely going to um, discuss the new hit singer now, man. So y'all don't go nowhere, man. Keep it locked right here at WNBC 90.1. That's when we beat you. Oh, what's up, bro? So, um, yeah. yeah, I got you live, bro. You already, my bad, you already yeah. on what? Um, what, uh, what the station got an IG and shit? Yeah, um, the, we got the, uh, we, we got a Facebook. It's, um, what, 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 what the IG? You got an IG? I got an IG, yeah. It's, it's Jerk531. You gonna see, you gonna see, uh, <laughs> your, uh, we've been promoting. Nah, hell no. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dirt 531. It's, uh, I got you. Um, yeah, uh, you're going to see yourself over there a few times, man. You've been promoting that interview for uh, about a week or two now. Yeah, yeah. But, um, yeah, most of the stuff, most of our social media, man, I don't like we do through Facebook. Yeah, that's what our biggest problem, man. Chase this money, this money, this money. Let me see it. What they do, huh? Yeah. Oh, this is this is this. I'm trying to make it go up and down. Okay, okay, who all in this month? This ain't the this ain't the radio shit. It's yours. That's mine, who radio. all in this motherfucker? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> hey, I'm trying to be big, man. I need some followers, man. Mike Smith 305, man. Say say you motherfucking jerk the nigga that nigga, you heard? Man, let me get about 50 followers, man. You know what I'm saying? We need about 50, you feel me? Need about 50, you dead? Know what I'm saying? Mike Smith, 305. Yeah, dig him, what, DJ, DJ Dig him down? No, DJ Dick him 305. Okay. Yeah, DJ Dick him 305. We need about 50, that's it. You know what I'm saying? Support hard working good music, you know what I'm saying? You did. Yeah, we in the city, man, you know what I'm saying? I'm hanging out, man. Vibing, you did. Yeah. 
90.1, y'all tune in, man. Y'all in the city tune in. We finna talk that shit, you feel me? You did. We got a lot to talk about, man. We got a lot going on, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot going on, man. Say you gonna slide through, cat. Okay? Yo, what's going on, y'all? WBT, man, the point when that's in the beat, man. Yo, man, we got a real treat for the city today, for real, man. Like I said, man, I th we got the hottest rapper in Florida yeah. right now. I, I, I think one of the hottest rappers in the game right now. Yeah, yeah, put me in the game. Yeah, man. my bad, man. You gonna yeah, yeah, like that, game, man. I got Mike saying? Smith, man. Yeah. Slip and slide artist. Yeah. I know y'all y'all been hearing us saying the now. For the past what about a month or so with the ten camera sample on yeah. that man, bro. I, I just want to say thank you for coming through first nah, of all. Man, I appreciate dog. you for having me, man. man. You know what I'm saying? Bro, bro, I, I guess the first thing I want to talk about, man, is like Florida so big. Yeah. Uh South Florida, that's a whole thing to itself. Yeah. And bro, you done navigated and, and kind of took the ranks of the, the, the hottest hottest rapper out right now, I would say. Yeah, yeah. Um I want you to talk about a little bit, man, that journey, man, coming up, cause it, we we got a we got a million rappers now, a million yeah. good rappers too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so, so, so how you how you separate yourself, man? I just been working hard, man. Like it ain't been no overnight thing, man. You know what I'm saying? Not. I've been hustling for ten years, and I always like went that extra mile. I knew what separated me from everybody was gonna be how hard I, I was willing to work. You know what I'm saying? That's true. Cause man, everybody know how to rap and sing and. Talent is everywhere, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. And everywhere you go, like, man, people is dope, you know what I'm saying? They spin, they got yeah. lyrics, they make beats, they they good at what they yeah. do, you know what I'm saying? So it's all about how hard you're willing to work, man. And I always went that extra mile, man, you know what I'm saying? I, I always, like, out hustle, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, a yeah. lot of people, even a lot of people that, 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 that I started with, you know what I'm saying? Like, man, these boys done laid down and they don't want to rap no more, you know what I'm saying? Like, they, you know... It, it, Cause it ain't easy, but I just outworked everybody, man. You know what I'm saying? And, and I really like grind my way in the position and put my name in it in the ranks. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like yeah. when when they talk about Lord, I need my name to come up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I ain't gotta be be the hottest, but then bring my name up. Put yeah, some respect yeah. on my name too. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that, that's all I ever wanted. You that's know what I'm saying? Up. Hey, bro. Um you just mentioned like it wasn't no overnight thing. You've been getting in there for a minute. I know you've been yeah, probably man. rapping all your life. I've been rapping all my life. I've been really grinding for 10 years. That's you know real. what I'm saying? That's real. Plus, you feel me? Because it's like, you know, like, you be thinking you be grinding sometimes, you don't be grinding, man. Right, you know right, what I'm saying? Right. You just be making music and letting your homeboys hear it. Yeah. They ain't really grinding, you know what I'm saying? But I've been really, like, networking and, you know what I'm saying, doing songs with people and promoting my stuff and passing out CDs and moving around different places and really creating a demand, like really like grinding, getting my stuff out there for 10 years plus, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, 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 that seems to be like a, a theme with you, man. I, yeah, I, I, yeah. I, I, from me doing my research on you, bro, that's one thing you, I, I've seen you talk about a lot is the hustle, is, yeah, really, yeah. is, is investing in yourself and, and uh, spending money on yourself in order to make yourself yeah, better. Yeah. I pride that, myself on I really, work, um, man. That, I think that really says a lot. I want you to talk about a little bit about what it's like to be like a, uh, uh, I, I say like how they saw after like a like a top draft pick. I know you signed out to yeah, to the yeah, yeah. but it was a bidding war for you. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. man, talk about a little bit about that because that's one of that that even that level right there is, is somewhere like a lot, a lot of artists try to attain to get to to be to be uh so so uh sought after man. It, 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 it was really like a mindset with me like like I really like put everything on me. You know what I'm saying? Right. As far as like I could I control what I can control, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Like if I run into a certain DJ or certain artist or certain program directors or just people in a position of power, like in his music business, if they don't know who I'm is, I always look at it like, man, I got more work to do, man. You That's know what I'm saying? I never look at it like, 
man, he tripping, man. He he hating, he sleeping on me, man. I'm the I'm the hottest in it. I'm good. Mm -hmm. I always look like you don't know who I'm in. I got more work to do, man. You know what I'm saying? I gotta keep grinding. And that's how I always like try to motivate myself and just keep hustling, man. And and like with, with like as far as like the bidding war, like you would think it'd be like, you know what I'm saying, exciting. But it's really scary, man. You talking about them <laughs> put your name on paperwork, yeah, man. Yeah, that's just it. Like, man, so many people like mess up their whole career because you don't work yeah, so man. hard yeah. just to sign with somebody, and, you know what I'm saying, for them to does not see your vision right. or sleep on what you got yeah. going on or right. self you or put you in a position where you can't put out music or you can't do what you want to do and move how you was moving. That's really like taking a risk when you don't came so far. You know what I'm saying? Right. That's, well, well, well. That's something I'm gonna ask you about later. But I'm, I'm gonna get into it now. Like, what would you now that you're at the level you at now? What would you like tell yourself a year or two ago that you learned? You know what I mean? Throughout this process, like what 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 came up that you didn't expect? You know what I mean? It, 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 it was always trial and error. You know what I'm saying? With everything, we had no blueprint, man. Right. Especially like the way like. The music business is set up now. It ain't really no right or wrong way to do it, man. It's yeah. people that yeah. that blowing up on the internet, uh -huh. blowing up on IG, okay. blowing up with you get a one hot song that mm -hmm. take off, or you get a cosign from somebody. You you know it's it's a lot of different ways to yeah, to, yeah. to do it. You know what I'm saying? So like, I don't really re regret nothing I, I I went through, man. It took me a long time, but it it, it, it matured me. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It prepared me for this. So you know what I'm saying? I feel like. Everything I'm seeing now on this level, I already done seen it just on a smaller scale. Yeah. So I'm, I'm prepared for it, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying, for for whatever. I done seen it, you know what I'm saying? I done been in the mud for real. So and then it made me like a boss too. Like, yeah. like man, you can't come around me and say, like, ain't, ain't nothing. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm confident in what I got going on. I know who I am, you know yeah. what I'm saying? That's I'm confident in my team. Because when you blow up overnight, you end up having a lot of people around you yeah. there. Don't mean right. no well, you know what right. I'm saying? Right. You you know when they get weary and you when you in them trenches and you grinding and then they go to hitting you with, boy, boy man, ain't nobody calling man. Nah. What they talking about man? Ain't nobody trying to find you. And you when you go to get them, they getting tired. You yeah. know what I'm saying? <laughs> so man, everybody you see around me, man, we've been in the trenches like really getting it yeah. in for years. You that know was, what I'm saying? It, it, that that's something that I think is is constant with all successful teams. Yeah. Man. Like, that real blood, that, that family, even if it ain't your man. blood family, but that family, yeah. you know what I'm saying, that family happens to be behind thick and thin, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna ride about you, you know what I'm saying? But it's like, if, if, if it happened overnight, then you end up having to, like, we certain people uh, out, like, why are you having this success and why all this stuff going on? And they move fast, you know what I'm saying? So that's why a lot of people end up dropping the ball, you know what I'm saying, having the wrong people around them, and you know what I'm saying? Like, it just The team just don't be right and we don't be knowing how to move. By, by, by me and my team, we done been together so long in the trenches. So, nah, man, we ready, man. Yeah, yeah. And we still learning every day, but, you know yeah, what I'm really saying, man? We ready, yeah, man. Ready, yeah, man. we were ready, man. Hard hat, 10 strap mouthpiece, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We ready, you know what I'm saying? That's a real. Got to talk about football in South Florida. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about. Hey, so tell me this, too, bro. Um, you went through the bidding wall. Like, you, you very, you know, like I say, top draft pick, man, I, I'll say. But you end up signing with Slip and Slide. Yeah. Whole team. Yeah. Tell me about that. How that all came together, man. And it felt it felt like good. It felt right. You know what I'm saying? As far as like man, people don't understand this Florida thing, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? That's what I really want to talk about, bro. Our, our, our vibe and our lingo and our swag and you know what I'm saying, man, we like different type of beats and different sounds and you know what I'm saying? And we, and we got a whole nother vibe now. It's something in the water, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so it's like, man, you sitting down with people that ain't from where we from, they don't get it, you know what I'm saying? And they, and they try to put you in the studio with people that, that don't understand your sound and understand your vision for you, your, what you trying to paint, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, that that was the problem with everybody else I sat down with. They just ain't get it, man. I done sat down with people that say they only sign me if I change my name, you know wow. what I'm saying? My name not marketable, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Oh, Mike Smith, I don't think that's, you know, that ain't no marketable name, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, all type of stuff, man. I have fly, people fly me all in LA and Atlanta and yeah. sit me down and just to talk stuff that just don't make sense, you know what I'm saying? But with the slip and slide, they, they, that's, they know exactly what I'm right. trying to do, you know what I'm saying? They fit. done did it, you know what I'm saying? Perfect fit. That's the perfect fit for mm -hmm. my vibe and... and and that, and, that, and that sound and, and feeling I'm trying to bring back to the music, you know what I'm saying? That's real. And they, and they fought the fault. 
they, they, they don't that I gotta fight. You know what I'm saying? As far as you know, when 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 they came out, they had to break a lot of barriers because you know Florida and Miami, we just was known like for the booty shaking because mm-hmm. Uncle Luke was so big. You know what I'm saying? Crazy legs and Uncle Al and all these people was so big, but they did that. You know what I'm saying? That up tempo club music. So when Double Them was coming out, you know what I'm saying? The Lost Tribe and all them was coming out talking that street stuff and telling stories and talking that pain in real life and like they ain't a lot of the industry ain't really accepted so they had to really jump a lot of hurdles and they had to really fight a war to get yeah. across to the world like man we go through real stuff too we ain't only like no party and booty shaking state city you know what i'm saying like man we got that real life going on so they had to fight that fight and they broke them barriers you know what i'm saying for for us to be able to talk this street stuff and then you know with me i'm kind of fighting the same fight with Everybody making the type of music they making now with the, the auto tune and the mumble and you know what I'm saying and you know man I'm and I'm all the way to the left with it you know what right. I'm saying I'm talking that pain that that real life that struggle that you know what I'm saying so so it ain't popular what I'm doing so right. I gotta fight that same fight well, and slip and slide they done did it and been successful at it you know what I'm saying so they uh, they get me and, and they allow me to drive the car with her you know what I'm yeah, saying that's what's up. yeah that's so they like right. man they believe in what I got going on so it, it, it was just it's just a blessing man you know what I'm saying? right I I I really I always compare like South Florida the music scene down now to like Houston where they are like it's so big that they a lot of times y'all have certified stars down there like Triple J and Ball yeah, Green yeah, yeah, and yeah. people like that who Maybe nationally not, might not have as big a following, but now no, they they let him down. Now, yeah, you know what, yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mike Smith too. Yeah. So what I'm saying, bro, I really want to commend you for uh, ex- 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 expanding. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah Expanding because yeah. that's hard to break out of. Bro. Get up, get up out that that, that up, gumbo, man. Yeah, right, right, what I'm saying. So I like. You, know if you don't move your feet, you can't eat, man. That's you got to move around. <laughs> I heard you say yeah, that, though, but that's man, real, you though. Gotta, you got to yeah. go out to rough your home, man. You know what I'm saying? Well, you got to win them away games, man, um, to get that chip, man. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, um, let me ask you this, man. Two things, actually. Um, well, actually, first, what, 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 what you trying to accomplish, man, as far as, you know, in this game? When we trying to go down we're and make it a We just trying to get a bunch of money, you know yeah. what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, we, we, we try to... We try to come back with them bags so big, they about to bust open, you know what I'm saying? We trying to, we ain't turning out no money, That's man. Real. We want all the money, you know what I'm saying? We trying to do movies, commercials, and, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Endorsements, and, man, That's we want it all, you know what I'm saying? We, we trying to get the money, man. But, but like, on the music tip, man, I'm just trying to, man, tell my story, man, yeah. and show people that been through what I've been through, and that's yeah. from where I'm from. That man, it ain't no excuse, man. You know what I'm saying? Like I did it, man. You know what I'm saying? That's real. Cause it's it, like if you don't see nobody do it, you'll think it's impossible. That's you know real. what I'm saying? You gotta see yourself. Gotta yeah, see somebody look yeah. like you, man. You gotta like see it, like man. He really came from where I'm from. That and, movie, that movie, Black Panther. They see that movie, yeah, little kids see that see movie. It, it's the number one movie in the world, man. Seeing is believing, man. That's and, real. And I like our kind, man. We dying, man, every yeah. day and going to prison and yeah. making bad decisions, man. It's like. Somebody gotta show them if you're willing to work hard and you're ready to put it put it all on the line and endure the the rain and the pain. It, it, it's gonna get greater later. You know what I'm saying? And that's Amen. that's just what I represent. You know what I'm saying? All right, cool, bro. Yeah. Well, bro, let me let, let, let me talk to you a little bit about um, the mayor, T W yeah. D, man. Cause I'm see, I know yeah. he's influ- influential yeah, to you, yeah. man. Uh, did he have anything to do with you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Slide? Of course, of course. Yeah. He, you gotta get his blessing, you know That's what I'm saying? Good. Yeah, it, it won't. It, it'll be uncivilized otherwise, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But, but he the one called me. Cause you know I've been rocking with Double like way before right. I met. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Touche and Ted Lucas and the staff over there. They, you know, I, he like really like. Cause I was hot where I'm from. Uh-huh. You know what I'm oh, saying? Definitely. We, like in, in, in my little area down south. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like from. Coconut grow through Florida City, like man, I've been hot since 2008. You know what I'm saying? That's real. So they like, you know, like other parts of Miami probably never heard of me. Other parts of Florida at that time haven't heard of me, but you can't go nowhere south of Coconut Grove and they don't know who I was. You know what I'm saying? So anybody that know Trick, man, he in every hole in the wall club in every hood. Yeah, yeah. And every so he know what's going on. You know what I'm saying? So. Mm-hmm. He used to be down south partying, man, in our clubs, and you know what I'm saying, in the cut with the gangsters and the G's, and 
he they know what's going on, you know what I'm saying? So he took me up on his wing, really like taught me a lot, you know what I'm saying? Like he he gave me a lot of advice, like even in the studio, he, he showed me how to study music, you know what I'm saying? Go back and listen to old music and you know what I'm saying? Old R and B and old school and them vibes and he showed me like a lot of his biggest songs, he was showing me how how he got ideas just on listening to them old records and you know what I'm saying? You come up with different concepts. Yeah. Even with the performing, he took me on road on the road with him. You know what I'm saying? With the Legends of the South tour with oh, him okay. and Juvenile and Bun B and right. Eight Ball and you know what I'm saying? Juvenile and Mystical and Pastor Troy. Right. It was just big. You know what I'm saying? For me to like go from them hole in the wall spots to be in different cities. You know what I'm saying? We jumping on and on and out planes and in and out of sprinters. You know what I'm saying? And we performing in arenas and. You know what I'm saying? And auditorium was like, you know, it was 7,000 people, 10,000, 15,000 people. It was life changing and eye opening, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, he, he taught me a, a lot and he never asked nothing from me. Like, wow. he ain't never asked me to sign with him or, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Or he just like wanted to help me, you know yeah, what I'm saying? And, and a lot of people that we was running into, man, they want to send an email without you signing with them or, wow. you know what I'm saying? Or giving them yeah. something. Stuff that don't cost them nothing, you know what I'm saying? And not only was he taking me on the road, he was paying me too, you know what I'm saying? Wow. He get all these, he break me out, make sure I'm good, you know what I'm saying? So, man, can't nobody <laughs> tell me nothing about double, you know that's what I'm real, saying? Like, real, man, man. And, and what that'll do is that'll that'll instill out of you for the next generation. Yeah, you know he I'm showed me, you know what I'm saying? Like, real, you know what I'm saying? So, and, but he called me. I've I've had a relationship with him for years, you know what I'm saying? And he he just called me out the blue, like, man. He say, man, uh, Ted Lucas want to holler at you, man, you know what right. I'm saying? Right, so I was like, man, who is Ted Lucas? <laughs> he like, man, that's what I do, man. He, he on Slip and Slide, mm -hmm. man. Well, I thought Touche on Slip and Slide. Nah. Like, that's the same people, man. <laughs> Ted Lucas, the nah, same people. Nah, I didn't know that. Nah, yeah, I never knew that. People. So he like, man, he like, man, we gonna uh, sit down and, I thought uh, Touche was a producer making the beat. Nah, man, that's the same person, man. But he was like, uh, man, we gonna go. Come on, man. Man, we gonna go sit down and... and and, and if you like, you feel comfortable, you know what I'm saying, we're going to make it make sense, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what we did. That's real, bro. That's real, man. Listen. All right. Uh, we kind of grew up in the same era of yeah, music yeah, and yeah, listened yeah. to the same influences. I, uh, one of my my top five rappers is Trick Dad. You yeah, know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. You, I get looked up from that. Right? The people, yeah, Trick Dad, yeah, nah, yeah. Trick Dad, the one I grew up yeah, on. Yeah, I'm you, talking yeah, about yeah. from based on the true story. If you ain't from where we from, you won't understand. Exactly. Yeah. That's what I want you to talk about. Now, you know Trick Dad personally. Yeah. Um, a lot of us don't. Yeah. I want you to talk about what it's like growing up listening to Trick Dad. What, what you learn, because... My opinion, he one of the best storytellers in hip hop. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. My my personal attention to his life, based yeah, on all yeah, that ain't yeah, nothing yeah. but a bunch of good storytellers. So I want you to talk about it as an artist now. I mean, like I say, you know him personally, but we don't know him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. What 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 kind of gems you know? You know, what I'm saying? What, not not even what kind of gems, but describe what it's like growing up listening to Trick Daddy, being from Florida, and Trick Daddy like our daddy in hip hop pretty yeah, much. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. But my man, it's, it's just uh. That's dope, man. That was my favorite rapper too. And my, right. my top five is, is Trick Daddy Dan too far. Right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> just, you know what I'm saying? just keeping it real, you know what I'm saying? That's real, like, man. Yeah. It's it just surreal, man. That's like real. my favorite rapper, like of all time, like for me growing up like a little kid, mm -hmm. fifth grade, mm -hmm. fourth grade, sixth grade, man, that's all I listen to is Trick that in a whole slip and slide movement, you know what I'm saying? Case 100, the low That's all we had. That's all we had. That's all we had. That's all we had. Because, you know, we came up when there wasn't no internet. So right. we only right. listened to what we heard in our neighborhood and right. what we heard on right. our local radio stations and what people was playing around our way. And we didn't really know what was going on in other cities and states unless they was big or unless it was Puff or Big, right. you know what I'm right. saying? Right. But as far as like they local scene and they local vibe. We ain't really know nothing about it. We only knew what was going on in our city. Not we only knew JT Money JT and the Money. Poison Clan. Uh, you know what I'm saying? We only knew Trick Daddy and Trina. You know what I'm saying? That's the only thing we knew. We so it's it, it just like it's surreal though for like all yeah, these years. You know, on the same stage. For me to be on a, you know what I'm saying? For me to have it's a song real, with Trick and Trina, rocking the same stage with them, the ad living. You know what I'm saying, baby? Because I'm a thug. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. like, it's like really crazy, you know what I'm dream, saying? Dream come true. Boy. Yeah, it, it really like, it, it's real. It feels good, though. Well, bro, talk about, you just mentioned it a little bit. I want you to talk about that a little bit, too. Let me say that all the time up here, too. Paradise. Yeah. Um, 
how all that came together, and then you just touch on it a little bit, man. You 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 with the king and queen of hip hop yeah, yeah, floor, yeah, you know what I'm saying? That's crazy, bro. I just, I just try to learn as much as I can, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Good and bad. That's real. But you gonna learn bad too from that. You, know, you, <laughs> you gonna form some bad habits. You know what I'm saying? So I try I try to learn as much as yeah. I can, man, because they've been doing it a long time. You know That's what I'm real. saying? 20 plus years, man. That's real. That's real. And boy, a lot of people done came and went in them 20 years, and yeah. they still here. Yeah. Still getting booked and still know how to rap. Mm. And still getting performed and still got fans. You they know what I'm saying? Everywhere we go. Mm. But it's like, they legends, man. And real legends. I be a fool to be around them and don't learn nothing. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. when I be around, I try to do less talking and more listening. You know what I'm saying? That's when true. I get around them, I learn a lot. Even, even how to move, like, you know what I'm saying, with my team. And, you know what I'm saying? I see how he move with his team, and you know what I'm saying? And how Trina be moving. I, I I really like. I want to be as far as like in a, in a, in the music business. I want to be. I want to move how Trina be moving, man. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I mean Trina, she cool with everybody, man. She came for that bag, and yeah. it's known. You know what yeah. I'm saying? I ain't got time for all the beefing mm -hmm. and all the. The hating and all the negativity, man. I came to get some money, man. Trina, it was one time in hip hop. Trina was the only female seller. Yeah, I'm man. talking about about five years before Minaj yeah. came around. It was Trina selling. That's the only yeah, maybe Mitch Elliott and little bit. Trina, Trina, well, Trina, Trina, Trina like taught me how to move in a room full of vultures, man. You That's know what I'm saying? <laughs> she she go anyway and she cool with everybody. You yeah. know what I'm saying? It ain't no fake two faces. Mm -hmm. Like nah, ain't no plan both sides. It's just her personality don't get me in the middle of that BS, you know what I'm saying? I'm about the bag, man. Where the that's money at? You know what I'm saying? So yeah. she, she, just me watching her, man. And she taught me man. that, you know what I'm saying? That's amazing, bro. Yeah. Like, like, like you in a real uh, grateful situation, man. Yeah, you gotta take advantage, man. That's you gotta, real. like, you gotta know when to shut up, and you know what I'm saying? Man, take notes, man, and you know what I'm saying? So I learned a lot, man, in this little bit of time that I've been around. You know what I'm saying? The, the slip and slide vibe and the movement and just hearing the stories and the, you know the Rick Ross stories and the Ply stories and the, you know what I'm saying? You know they got a long roster. Getting over the there. Real I, mean, I got big shoes to fill over there. Real deal, you know what I'm getting saying? the real deal gems left. Yeah. Well. That's real, dog. Hey, so tell me this, man. With Paradise, um, that's that's on the TNT album, but you gonna yeah, have that? Yeah. You, you 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 gonna release that on yours too? Or? Nah, that's that's they um, that's second that. single that they put out. Her. And it was dope, and then we, and then that's dope. I, I did, we did that before I signed too. Oh, I didn't know so that. That just was on some, you know that's what I'm saying? Yeah, that's just the city love right yeah, now. Yeah, it's just like, you know what I'm saying? That's why I really feel uncomfortable because it's like they was more on some, man. Let's get some money, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get some money together. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, man, we see what you doing. Let's get that's some money together. Lot. That's yeah, it lot. wasn't like I ain't feel like I was doing that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, 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 you know what I'm saying? Really down hard, oh, like, man, you got to sign this or do this before we can do, make a phone call for right, you. You know right, what I'm right, saying? Right, right, right. They really was on something, man, let's do it, man. You know what I'm saying? Before paperwork or anything, I was just coming around like a whole that's, month and just that's real, that's vibing, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And getting gems and coming through recording, you know what I'm saying? And they ain't wasn't really pressuring me about signing or nothing, you know what I'm saying? So it was like, man. Oh, man whole, what it sound like, bro, what it sound like they doing, uh, you know what I'm saying? I got to shout out Bob Greasy, too, for what he yeah, doing yeah, right yeah, now, Bob too, Greasy, man. Yeah. But what it sound like they doing and, and, and what's going on with, with the whole, I, I want to say South Florida music, but, but, but Florida movement, uh, sound like they putting y'all in position to just carry the torch, you know what I'm saying? We got a way, we got a way coming, man. That really made me excited, you know what I'm saying? We got a way like, coming, man. That's real, bro. You know bro. what I'm saying? You know the spotlight shifting out here to Florida. Mm -hmm. So I'm just, I'm just happy to be one of the, in the They were biting our style for a minute, though. I'm telling y'all, man. Oh, yeah. I, you well, know, that why when we, I heard when we, Trick Daddy say this, man. That whole bass movement, I'm yeah, not, yeah. that wasn't nothing but Florida music, that bro. We, when we get you know when we get the torch, it's going to be here for a long time. Yeah, that's real, But we got some, we got some dope, you know what I'm saying? That's all that, man. Everything good down here, From the top of Florida all the way down to Key West, we got some talent. That's real, bro. I'm just happy to be in the mix, you know what I'm saying? Well, that that brings me to my next question, man. Um, we, see, I, I keep jumping over myself, but uh, I wanted you to talk a little bit about that whole wave down there y'all got going on, man. Little dread, ball green, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Because y'all doing big things right now. Yeah, Music, yeah, I always yeah. have, you know what I'm saying? But because yeah. because I learned a lot. I learned I, I get a lot of that South Florida music. Um, from all the people from Miami, and they come yeah, up here, they got whole yeah. completely different music we listen to up yeah, here. Like, yeah, 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 that's, that's how I like it. Wherever they go, they gonna put on. You oh know yeah, what I'm oh yeah, they, they gonna real hard too. Believe that. 
So I'm saying, well, you know what I'm saying? You just want to touch on that. Yeah, I just, bit. I just like, you know, we always had our own vibe down there. We a whole nother world down there. Yes, you know sir. what I'm saying? Yes, sir. So, um, I just, I'm just, I'm just thankful to be among some of these people that I grew up listening to. Oh. For, for me, like. So really, like, I'm in a position, like, man, I rock with everybody, man, you know what I'm saying? And, like, man, everybody really, like, support what I got going on, man, you know what I'm saying? Me right. and Bob Greasy real good, right. you know what I'm saying? Like, man, I'm on Bay Day 1 and 2, you I dead? Do. I'm on 1 <laughs> and 2, you dead? So, you know what I'm saying? I'm man, man, Greasy, man, good, you know what I'm saying? Man, anybody you can name, man, Billy and Good, man, Billy Blue, Piccolo, JT Money, Man, whoever you can name, man, we good, man. Yeah, Dread, yeah. Jimmy Day, you know what I'm saying? And with that kind of unity, boy, ain't nothing, can't nothing like, stop. Like, I rock with everybody. Ain't nobody stop the whole movie. Buster Free, man, whoever you can name, you know what I'm saying? I, and I'm, I'm happy to be one of those people that the bridge the gap, man, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and let people know, like, man, it ain't about, you know what I'm saying? All that street stuff is, we trying to get some money, man, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, I, man, I come through, I rock with Blaze Card, I rock with, you know what I'm saying? Whoever, you know what I'm saying? I, like, see, I see you mess with a lot of football man, players, man. Everybody, too, man. man. Yeah, I got a lot of homeboys. You know, I play football, so, you know, I got a lot of homeboys who play ball with me. I ain't no dropping out, but yeah. them boys kept going, them boys uh, in the league right now, you know what I'm saying? It's always good to see that. Dollar, you did. That's what's up. Yeah. I like to rap well, man. Listen, um... We, this, this is a personal question myself, man, I got for you, man. Uh, I always want to ask y'all, man. I want y'all to talk about and uh, describe <laughs> the Pac Jam, the Hey Hey, and, and Goombay. Because we don't got none of that up here. Like, tell me what those are, because I, I don't really know. But I know I, 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 all I know is it's very exciting, and it's something I want to be at. I ain't never been. Man, the Hey Hey and the, uh, and the Pac Jam, you know, I'm 28. That's, that's, that's back in the day. That's my old girl, and I mean, Joe, yeah. and I mean. When they were wild in there, and there was a whole lot of, a whole lot of drugs, slanging yeah, and machine yeah. gun toting. We, we, we were kids. Yeah, yeah, I was legit, but the goon, but you know what I'm saying? It just, it's just a vibe, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, man, it's just big speakers everywhere. You know, we put them walls up down there. You know what I'm saying? Hanging out. Man, big speakers. We bring out the Vegas. Put them bass bands up. <laughs> we bring the Vegas out. You know what I'm saying? We're talking about big walls. Might be a 20 pack. Dice games and what time of year they do that? Out, man. You know what I'm saying? They don't do that no more. Oh, it's man. old. Yeah, man. Okay, that had to be. We ain't got nothing no more, man. Okay. Okay. We, we mess up everything. You we know how it go, man. Yeah, we but killing people down there, man. That's what, that, that, that what we here for, though. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? We're going to bounce back. The Martin Luther King parade ain't even the same no more, man. You know what I'm saying? They got more of that, I don't know. They, that ain't the same no more. They kicking other people getting killed on the beach, man. They kicking them from out there, too. They, what they do, they, they don't shut it down on Memorial Day weekend, but. Yeah. They make it so hard yeah, for you to, oh, it's only one way in, one good. way out. Oh, no loud music. Oh, no. They have police on there, Conan. Man, my homeboy got killed out there talk. last year, man. They like, you know, they find ways to keep our kind from out there. They know, man, once, once we say, we well, can't play no loud music, police on here, Conan, we can't yeah, smoke, we, we can't. Yeah, man, no BBRG5, <laughs> I'm good. That's real, bro. Well, look, man, we'll talk about a little bit of everything, yeah, man. man. Let's talk, let's it, talk man. about, no, 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 let's talk about what you came in for, what we're yeah, doing, yeah, yeah, which, is, new record. which is the now record. The new record, I say that for the end, bro. The new record, record, man, I'm right. proud of this record right here, man, you know what I'm saying? Only because, you know, people, like, taking to it and, like, really going crazy about it. A lot of radio stations are adding it, you know what I'm saying? Like you said, y'all been playing it every hour. We've been playing it for about a month. Now, listen, I know as soon as it came out on, on yeah, uh, yeah. where we get our music from. Yeah, y'all been we, playing, playing it every yeah. hour. I've been getting a lot of support, and, and it's, like, different from, like, getting no support from a, a, a club record. Or, right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? Well, like, see, a party record. This is personal for me, exactly. you know what I'm saying? Like, if you listen to what I'm talking about in my verses, it's like, I'm really talking about that transition from... You know what I'm saying? Where I came from and right. where I'm at now. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and people like you know. Tell, tell me how that. Tell me how that can be helpful for just a little, a little, a little 16, 17, 20 year old on the block right now listening to that. Cause yeah. that, cause that, cause that song isn't a typical club record or yeah, whatever. That's yeah, something yeah. you gotta sit down and like. So yeah. tell me, tell me how that can help or what and you said. Let's go food. back to what I represent, man. What I stand for, man. I represent. Hope, man, you know what I'm saying? Like, man, I'm the voice of the voiceless. You know what I'm saying? I'm representing, like, the people that's coming from night, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about the homeless people in the bases and 
thongs and strippers and dope boys and you know what I'm saying? I, I represent that. But like I'm 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 the one that's trying to show people like man that ain't the only way to you know what I'm saying? Because we we come from an environment where, where everything be so like bad and you would think that life is messed up, you know what I'm saying? Because when you walk out your door, man, everybody broke, you know what I'm saying? Everybody like, man, your, your, your daddy in prison or he ain't around. And, man, nobody in your neighborhood or none of your homeboys, daddy don't live with them, you know what I'm saying? Right, right, right. But it's like, man, everybody broke or getting shot or killed, people getting pregnant, young age, man, people, police killing us and beating us up and, you know what I'm saying? People, houses getting broken too, you gotta, like, man, it's like, it's like just crazy and chaotic, you know what I'm saying? Like, the environment we come from and, and you never, like, they know where you would think, man, life messed up. Because it's all you know, you know right, what I'm saying? Right, right. But, man, I'm trying to show people, man, life ain't messed up. That environment messed up, you know what I'm saying? Right. You got to step outside that environment and get around some people that want something, you know what I'm saying? Because it, I was hanging around people that, like I, I said in one of my songs, like, man, the homeboys that I had, you know what I'm saying, when I was, when I was in that environment, they teach you how to roll a blunt. They teach you how to load a pistol. They teach you... You know what I'm saying? How many ounces in the key, and you know what I'm saying? How how to how to break down pounds and all that. But you hang around different type of people, they'll put you up on different things, and they'll right. I, I know how to load a clip, but I don't know how to tie a tie. You yeah. know what I'm saying? I don't know how to fill out a job application or do a resume. And it's all about who you hang around, man. It's all about applying yourself, man, and, and, and all that, man. Oh, the white man and holding us down, man. All that excuses, man. You know what I'm saying? If you want it. Man, you got to get up and get out here and make it happen, you know what I'm saying? Whatever it is that you trying to do, surround yourself around people that's on what you want, you know what I'm saying? But if you, if you want to die in the hood, you want to sell dope all of your life, then hang around, hang around that. But I want more out of life, man, you know what I'm saying? We come from that, you know what I'm saying? At the same time, we ain't got to stay there, you feel me? We, let's that's power good. up, let's boss up, let's get some money, man, you know what I'm saying? And that, that's what I represent, man. Yeah. That, that, that now record is just telling my story, man, right. like... And we come from that, but man, we here now, we grind our way. It's my it's really my testimony, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? In two minutes. Now, um uh, the Wiseman Music Group produced the record. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that that come, where that concept came from as far as with, with the Teddy Campbell, man. What what I mean, really I ain't gonna lie, it was like all like just me feeding off them, you know what I'm saying? Like like man, they them boys got so much, man, so much work, man, you know what I'm saying? Like them boys, them boys got them vibes, you right, know what I'm right, saying? Right. They just were playing different, you know what I'm saying, stuff. And, you know, I just pick out what I like, and, you know, we adjust it from there, you know what I'm saying? I might pick out something, and, okay, I like that, but speed it up, but add, you know what I'm saying? But when I heard that, man, I just... That's what's up. That man. one of them late night sessions, too, yeah, man, man. That graveyard shit. And then, and I just sat down and wrote to it, and I could have went so many different ways like with it like yeah. for like yeah exactly how the sample is exactly. so open uh -huh. you've been in a love song you can uh -huh. be anything but that just, i just wrote what i felt at the time and yeah. and just me just it's a different vibe when you recording in, in that slip and slide studio and you seeing plaques on the wall and you seeing the thug rs plaques and the the triller rick ross plaques and you seeing trainer plaques everywhere you just it's just motivation man you know what i'm saying and, it just make you make you feel like man. That's amazing, well, I done bro. Came a long way, right, bro. right, right. Good boy, you and know I, what I'm saying? That's one thing I really uh I'm really like like I say, I'm almost giddy about it, man. Just the fact that uh you amongst that. That's something yeah, we all yeah, we all yeah, grew yeah. up on those giants. You need that, man. You need that. That's the reinforcement, bro. God, you know what I'm saying? Man, you know what I'm saying? Man, you know trick what daddy trainer do. Rick Ross Plies to be amongst that, man, greatness, mm -hmm. man, that and they be recording in the booth, you knew they recorded in, and you yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, and this yeah, man will be strolling through the computer, and you see Rick Ross' name on, oh boy, he got sessions over here, boy. You yeah, know what I'm okay, saying? Okay. You know? It's just like, man, That's it's just motivation, right, man. man. You know what I'm saying? That's good, bro. You got any, like, advice for up and coming rappers? Or? And I just want to say, man, just keep it, keep it the culture, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, where we from, represent where you from, man. You know what I'm saying? Let us know what's going on in your neighborhood. What's going on in your life? How y'all talk? What's y'all slang is? You know what I'm saying? I love you, know, you know, you know, the crew, we believe that woe is shown. And you know what I'm saying? We brought our culture to the yeah. to the forefront. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That, that stick and all that. That come from the crew. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, man, man, and we got to continue to do that, man. Cause we, we got all type of vibes and styles. And, right. You know what I'm saying? We got swag down here, man. You know what I'm saying? Wherever you from, 
man, represent that, man. Stand for your neighborhood, you know what I'm saying? Stand for your city, your county, you know what I'm saying? Let us know how y'all dress, how y'all talk, what's y'all vibe, you know what I'm saying? Don't try to, like, follow no trends and, you know, what's trendy, what's going on. Nah, man, ride on them beats that you like. Keep it yo, you know what I'm saying? Y'all like slow it down or fast or snap or whatever y'all vibe is, bring that to the to the world and bring people in your world, you know what I'm saying? And tell your story, man, because it's always somebody in the world that done either been through what you done been through or if they haven't, they're going to be interested when you telling your story, like, you know what I'm saying? Bring them in your world, like, man, I like, I like food, man, food, like, you know what I'm saying? I mean, that's why I always try to tell people, man, just keep it you, man. Keep it, keep it, keep that culture going, you know what I'm saying? Don't, don't forget the culture, man, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to forever make booty shaking music. I'm going to forever talk about sticks and AKs good, and, and Chevrolet's and, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Big booty girls and uh-huh. cunk fritters and crack cunk salad. And, don't forget them little booties, You know what I'm saying? Yeah, the little booties, too, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to forever, like... I just said I heard yeah, that on, yeah, I heard yeah, that on uh, yeah. uh, Junior Lady of the World with JT Bunn. I heard you talking yeah, about the little booties, Yeah, man, I'm going to forever, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to have the birthday girl. Yeah, I'm going to forever keep it the crib, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to forever respect Trick Daddy to the fullest. Respect Trina, you know what I'm saying? Respect Uncle Rick Luke. Ross and Uncle Luke mm-hmm. and Crazy Legs and JT Money and, you know what I'm yeah. saying? And Fuck uh, Boogie and, money, you know what I'm saying? And, and man, Buggy. all these people, Gorilla yeah. Tech and, you know what I'm saying? All the OGs and. Funk like, Boogie still with Slip and Slide? He, 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 he retired. I, 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 he retired. I, 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 I ain't met Funk Boogie yet, okay. man. So I don't, I don't really know. I, 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 I ain't heard that in a year. I need, I need back, one, dude. I need one. That's real, man. That's real, bro. Yeah, I need one. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to always. Show respect to the OGs, and I'm gonna show respect to the people that that laid the groundwork before me. You know what I'm saying? The Piccolos, and you know what I'm saying? The Vitos and Deathlock, and you know what I'm saying? And, 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 you know the the Briscoes, and I'm gonna already always say R.I.P. Bizzle and Toro, and you know what I'm saying? Man, the Bob Greasies and the Icebergs, and you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna always show respect. You know what I'm saying? And I'm gonna represent my crib, man. I'm gonna always say I'm from down south. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm gonna always represent. The Rams and Homestead and Florida City and Piran okay. and Goose and South Miami Heights. Real you know what I'm saying? And South Miami, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Down down. Coconut Grove and yeah. Richmond Heights. I'm always represent. And I ain't gonna never forget where I came from, man. I'm gonna keep it me to the That's dope, real. you know what I'm saying? Well, bro, they, it's amazing you saying that because they're gonna think I, I, I made you say that. I say that stuff all the time. But I want you to explain why that's important, man. Like, people, and the only reason I say that is because people, there's a there's there's a school of thought that you you can get in this game without taking that path as far as repping your city. Or, mm-hmm. There's people who move other places, change their whole. Stuff. Why 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 is it important to you? To, it's, you know it's all about it's all about how long you trying to be around. You know what I'm saying? Right right right. right. If, if you want the microwave effect, man, do that and, and you know what I'm saying. Get your money. And, you know what I'm saying? In <laughs> and, and, and two years, it's three years, be out of there. No, you yeah. know what I'm saying? But if you just look at the history of this, yeah. the biggest artists that's been around 10, 15, 20 years, these is people that represent they people mm-hmm. and they they the voice of of they city and they neighborhood and they look like and act like and talk like where they from. Right. And they tell their story. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? The Scarfaces. The Andre 3000s and the Outcasts, the, the, the Bad Boy Movement, you know what I'm saying? You know, the Tupac's and, you know what I'm saying, the Trick Daddies and, you know what I'm saying? These are people that represent where they from, the Jada Kisses, the Fabulous, the, you know what I'm saying? These are the legends, the Jay-Z's and the Nas's and the Biggie's and, man, they represent what they represent, and you respect them and love them for it, you know what I'm saying? Hey, well, you dropping gems right yeah, now. Yeah, I'm trying to be here. You dropping 20 gym. years from now, I'm going to be here, you, you know what I'm saying? You dropping gems right now, bro. We really are, and that's, a, and that's what, that's, I think, is the thing that we really need the most. Every, oh, you just named about 10, 15 artists right there. Yeah, yeah. And all of them have their own individual sound. Yeah, and they just kicking their The guns, legends, bro. man, even the Boosies and mm-hmm. the, oh, yeah. the Webbies and mm-hmm. it, you know what I'm saying? Man, when you hit them, man, you hit Louisiana, man, you know that's what I'm saying? Real. Yeah, and that's that's how I gotta be. You know what I'm saying? Represent the crib. Right, man. I know your business man will keep me in house. Yeah, we finna go to Val Austin, man. You know what I say? I need I need y'all to uh the the tag Fat Boy Rhymer. You know what I'm saying? And let them know that it's a new Fat Boy in town. <laughs> and, and I'm finna go up tonight. You and, 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 and it's most definitely I'm taking off my shirt tonight. So I might come without a shirt on. <laughs> No, I said I might show up without a shirt tonight, man. We hey, in about off to Georgia at Club Bliss tonight, man. We in Wake Cross, Georgia tomorrow oh, at the okay. Dome. 
Yo, we booked up, man. You know what I'm saying? My oh, team yeah, that rolling man. loud right now. Going ham, shout out the slipper slide style. They going ham. I went through and seen about twenty thousand CDs and Ooh. big posters and flies. What you, you think know when you see that, bro? What you think when you see that? We working. <laughs> we working. You know what I think? When I, when I went in the office and I seen yeah. twenty thousand CDs. I say, man, they got to be the bravest people in America yeah, hey, to be in here with all this dope in here like that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> man, the fans were man, to kick in at yeah. no end moment with all this dope in here sitting in here like that. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's good, though, man. No, that's, that's, that's good, that's, though, that, that they down there working while we up here getting it in, and that's yeah. what it's all about, man, that team. You know what I'm saying? Hey, man, y'all out there, man. IG, Mike Smith 305, YouTube, Mike yes, Smith 139. And uh, the Twitter the same thing, right? Mike Smith 305. Y'all make sure y'all go check out my dog, man. I'm telling y'all, bro. Yeah, nine five four seven eight nine seven five two three. Man, we coming through features and whatever book us bring, man. We if it turn a dollar, we ain't turning it down. We on our way, you know what I'm saying? That's real, man. Straight up, man. I'm gonna have games up, man. WBT ninety point one FM. Yes, sir. Really want to thank you for coming by, bro. Appreciate you, man. And like I said, man, we bumping pretty much Mike Smith everything. I probably hear from Val Lobster right now. About an hour, man. Uh, oh, get Rob on the yeah. phone. Hey, shot, Let him know. I'll be there in 45 minutes. <laughs> Put your dancing shoes on. Go do hey. some sit ups and push ups and jumping jacks. It's finna go down. Hey, y'all, don't go nowhere, man. Keep it locked right here. The rest of the hour, man. The rest of the day, man. We might smell fall day, man. We got, let me see, I got paradise. I say I want to play drills real quick. I ain't never yeah, played that man, before. Drill, Y'all want to just send me that drill, man. That drill, hey, man. Keep it we just sent you that steel record too, man. With me and Trick Daddy, man. We gotta run that uh, too. Man, we gonna, uh, so in that case, let's go ahead and do this. You know, the catalog deep, man, jerk, man. Just the catalog say, deep, baby. I just finna say, man. We work, man. Case, you know what I'm saying? We gotta go in there, man. Let's get right into it, man. Cause let's I wanna hear it. that steel. I ain't never heard it was for myself. But we going to steal? We going to steal. You want hey, to what they do, man? It's me. You pop them mic, smell the big belly rule. Boy, Mr. Florida, Mr. Down South, Dead County, Tommy Pike South, Exit 6. And right now you're tuned in, man, to the big station. The only station for R&B and hip-hop and the 352, you dig? And this right here is my record. It's called Still, featuring the big homie, t double D. Break out, hey, y'all. Booty Gang, CEO. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. <laughs> Not 400 degrees, B. Yeah, you know we you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, Oh. No, I didn't. I, I hit the button. Are you? What you saying? Oh, my God. <laughs> he said something funny, man. Hey, bro. He did that, bro. This is Chris, you the operations man. This is what you've been talking to the whole time. I'm fine. How you doing?